get up here. He did the whole thing himself. Oh yeah. That's what's up. Who's that supposed to be, Big Dog? Huh? Hold on. Oh, I know this cat. Actually, I know from the neighborhood. No, no, I don't. Who's that supposed to be, sir? Uh, I'm sorry? Guy's got talent, huh? Shh, crazy talent. Uh, he did all that by himself. That's what's up. The spray cans. Considering to the wall, it's not. It's like uh, not even flush with how you know uneven it is, especially up top. You know what I mean? To work to work under the conditions, it's not easy. Got some kind of writing there. The funny thing is, I don't know if he intended it to come out that way, but uh, 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 some of the lettering he has up there happens to be like Hebrew or Aramaic, or which I'm flowing in, you know, the original Arabic. And, and I, I, I see that it's English, but a lot of the letters happen to come out uh, uh, biblical Hebrew, mm. which I, it's for real. And uh, uh, you know, and I'm fluent in biblical and Aramaic, you know, original, uh, original Arabic and Hebrew. Mm. And, and I'm looking at it, and I see it's amazing, you know. And yeah. uh, especially like uh, this area here. Uh -huh. and, uh, now I know he he didn't intend it for it to be that way, but if you're looking, you know, Hebrew Arabic is read and written from right to left. As opposed to English language, which is left to right, mm -hmm. correct? It happens to be, even though these are English letters, or, or maybe it's not, maybe it's some other kind of language. But I know he's not intending it to be Hebrew. Every one of these letters from right to left is, is a Hebrew letter, which spells the Hebrew word. What does it uh, say? What, is that, is, what does that word right there is, say? Which is very interesting. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, so for exactly. instance, okay, I'll show you. So, for instance, right here. We have we have a, a letter Ches, which is sorry, the, the letter Ches, which is uh, oh, amazing, uh, so which happens to be the eighth letter of the Hebrew alphabet. Okay, we have the letter Ches, all right, mm -hmm. and and uh, 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 which, which is uh, this appears to be an Aleph, which is the first letter of 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 uh, the alphabet. Which always represents God. Mm. One always represents God. Mm. You know, the, the, there's nobody before, there's nobody after. Mm -hmm. Unity of one. Uh, so it's just infinite. So we got Ches, Aleph, Suf, which is the last letter of the Hebrew alphabet. So we go from the first letter all to the last letter. Mm -hmm. Encompasses all, right? Mm -hmm. and, 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 and the last letter could be. Interpreted as two two different type of letters. Uh, it could be uh, as a mem, right, mm. or a samach, the letter samach in the Hebrew alphabet. Mm. Now, let's see if we can make any kind of uh, 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 we can make any kind of sense when we put the letters together. Okay? Yeah. So let, let's try. All right. So we have ches. Okay. Okay. Um, if we, if we consider this, this last letter as a man, right? right? So it comes out, we would read it as Chatam. Okay? Ches, Aleph, Tash, Mem. Which would spell out, when you put them together, Chatam. Chatam. Right? Now, if you consider this as a Salmach, okay? We would have Ches, Aleph, Tuf, Salmach. And that would be Chatas. Mm. Okay? So we have two different words, chatam as opposed to chatas. Okay? Mm -hmm. Now, let me see if I give you interpretation. Uh, uh, some some words, not necessarily, you know, just because we put the letters together doesn't mean it has a, a, a translation. Okay. Right. Okay. Uh, uh, okay, so chatas, uh, well, if we break it down into its, uh, uh, into its roots, okay? Uh, hey, which is sin. Okay? Um, uh, and, and, and so, Chitas uh, is actually a word, there is a book, a biblical book called Chitas. And, 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 
and what he does is it's a uh, uh, it, it's a uh, uh, it's a collaboration. It's a, a mixture of of of, of the five books of Moses, yeah. right? Right. Uh, uh, and 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 along the top, and 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 Psalms from King David. Uh huh. Okay, and that's what Chita stands for. The uh, the acronym. It's an acronym for for the five books of Moses. Okay, Psalms. The book called Tanya. Which is the mystical writings of the, of the of the ancient books, the mystical writings of the Old Testament, known as Kabbalah. Mm. That's what Tiny is. That's the third letter of, of that that spells out the, the acronym, which is stands for Tanya. Mm. Okay, which is the mystical writings, the Kabbalah. I don't know if you ever heard of it. Of as the deep inner teachings of 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 the of, of the of the Bible. Very interesting that it spells out that word too. It's amazing. Uh, we right here on the wall. We see, you know. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's talking to us. The mm -hmm. wall's talking to us, and and, and it's t bringing us to God. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's covering uh, every angle. Uh, so mm -hmm. what do I mean by that? It's a protection around us, right? The five books of Moses, which is the Old Testament. Mm -hmm. Nobody debates that. Nobody denies it. Right. Nobody argues over it. Mm -hmm. All major religions and minor religions agree upon it. Mm -hmm. So we're in agreement with that. Mm -hmm. There's harmony with that, right? Mm -hmm. And Psalms, which is written by King David, nobody argues that either. We're all in agreement with that too, correct? Mm -hmm. And here too, I mean, Hebrew letters all over here. Psalm again, or Mem, like that last word, you see? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or here, the Tuf, which which was the, the third letter of that, the Tuf again. Mm -hmm. Lamed Lamed, which also represents God all the time. Mm -hmm. Huh? Nah. Uh, unbelievable. Unbelievable. Right? Uh, oh, and over here, the letter Vav of the Hebrew alphabet. Psalm, uh, Tuf, Samech, Vav, Lamed, Lamed. Mm. And, and this could be maybe passed as, as an Aleph. And, and this is a final nun. It's amazing. Hmm. Final room, which is one of the letters also in the Hebrew alphabet. All right. It's speaking all, I see all over here. Uh, this is all English, I know he's writing. And, and you look at it, it's all biblical Hebrew. It's amazing. I go word for word. And, and how come it comes out like that? Who the hell knows? <laughs> only God knows. Well, only God knows. You, you, if, you would say that even if you try to plan it out like that, in his best day in his life, he can never create that. You know, write down the English hoping that it's in reverse, it's going to be its Hebrew counterpart. Ah, uh, uh, that's deep. I'm serious. Yeah. Every word I can take you through. And, and everything's, a, everything's possible with the original man. Look at yeah, it. Yeah, but he had no, he not, his mind was the furthest from that, believe me. He was not even thinking of that. Mm. Uh, and, and it's God. That that only God created. That God uh, 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 intervened uh, with that. Huh? God moved His hand. Ah. See what I'm saying? Yes. God I truly believe that him. about Him and His art. That God moves His hand. Yeah. Uh, every, nobody. I don't know anybody who can do this. For some reason, God 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 controlled His hand. You know, moved His hand. That that this should come out like that. Huh? Mm, I've never it. seen anything like that in my life. He had no intention on that. For whatever reason, obviously he had some good intent. God is using him as his, uh, as his uh, 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 vessel. That's a very good thing. That's one with as his vessel to tell us something. So if we had a time one day when we come back, please and if do. we go through line by line, word by word, we can see the message that he's trying to give us the interpretation. Uh, amazing. They never been created that way. Take English words. Uh, mm. I'm telling you, mm. that is calligraphy. That's the original. The way Moses brought it down from the mountain. Mm -hmm. uh, that's the way it was written from God. Mm. God's hand to Moses. Wow. You see calligraphy. That's the calligraphy. That's what the original Bible, Ten Commandments, is written. I've been it. You feel like you got your proper dues.
because I know you study the writing styles and all that. We talked about that. I think it just came up like that. You don't know that you was a studier. You study all the